So the past month or so, I've been focusing on the shoulder press and I haven't managed to record all the workouts I've had. It's pretty inconvenient and um, I'm not, I don't have enough space on my phone. So I decided to collate all the clips I've had so far and put a, put a date, put a weight and give a rough timeline of how my shoulder press has been progressing the past month. Essentially, I have been progressing. I've seen quite a bit of improvement and I feel pretty strong. My approach has been to do the Candido six-week program, but instead of benching, I switch it up with the shoulder press. It's worked well. I've been responding well to it. And I don't see myself changing this approach in the next couple months. I'm going to keep this approach and I'm going to see if I can hit 100 kilos. And if I do, um, we'll see what I do from there. I think I might go back to calisthenics. I want to assess how well this raw strength transitions to calisthenics. I know it's going to do, um, it's going to be very beneficial, but it will take some time for my body to adjust to the joint stress and the specificity of uh, skills training. But yeah, for now, I like it. It's very simplistic. And I'm seeing progression. Now, in terms of my mindset throughout each of these clips, this was the first time I... Oh, sorry. Yeah, this is the, this was the first time I hit 80 kilos in nearly a year, I would say. Because the shoulder press was never my uh, focus. It was always calisthenics. And here was my PR of 90 kilos. Now, it moved fairly slow. I didn't get much sleep on this day either, and I was like jacked up on, I think like a coffee or something. But yeah, it was it was nice. Now after that, I took a deload. I moved on to another cycle of the Candido program, and uh, I just changed my PR to ninety kilos. Prior to that, it was eighty five, but yeah, I felt strong. Now. Over here, I believe this was the first week of the program and it required, sorry, this was the second week and it required me to do 72.5 for as many reps as possible and I managed to get 10 and I didn't record any of the other clips and then here it asked for 70 kilos as many reps as possible and I believe I managed 13, Um, I'm not quite sure but you can obviously tell that the form wasn't the best. I was just trying to wrap up uh, as many as I could. But I did feel pretty strong. Now, time is a pretty important factor in terms of these workouts. Uh, I think I already said it, but I, again, I'll just repeat it. I love how little time it takes to get my workouts done. It takes about an hour like an hour 15 max to get my workout done and I'm out. Typically, it's about 45 minutes. I get all of my uh, exercises done and I just go straight to uni. It's very convenient and for the rest of the day, I don't need to worry too much about it. And um, yeah, I I like it. Now, um, I will talk about this next clip here. This was uh, my workout today. It was 80 kilos for three sets of six. I was quite surprised. I think on my first set, I was a bit worried. Sorry, not worried. I was nervous because um, the max I've done with 80 was, I think, three or four reps. So getting it for three sets of six was um, a small achievement. So, um, you know, I wanted to celebrate that small step now here i put a weird angle here i think i was trying to assess how much I, um i arched my back because i have a very big tendency to arch quite a bit when i struggle and it's not ideal so i, didn't, I just wanted to see how much i arched i don't think you can see it properly there but yeah 
So these are the accessory movements I uh, typically do. So dumbbell and weighted pull-ups and some like rows. Here was 40 kilos. I think I was meant to get three sets of six. I think I got tired on my final set, so I just dropped it to 37.5. But it's been moving okay. I feel, you know, I feel strong. And um, again, I like the simplicity of just moving away up and down. <laughs> I don't know, it's just very appealing to me. But I'm eager to get back into calisthenics. So hopefully we'll see what happens from there. But yeah, I'll finish it up here. See you guys.